I am a loser. And I don't give a fuck. It's like food. For your ears. Welcome to All Things Audiobooks and Podcasts. I am Matt Cascoli, and on this channel, I'm going to be talking about Revenue and Audiobooks and talk about my favourite podcasts and recommending them. Today's, on today's video, I'm going to be talking about the subtle art, not giving a fuck, written by Mark Mason and narrated by Roger Wayne. Mark Mason is an entrepreneur and a blogger. He have written this book, The Son of Life, I'm Not Giving a Fuck. And what I like about this book, it really spoke to me, because he wasn't this bullshit of always be your best self. Uh, talks about, you know, just accepting your faults, your flaws, and, you know, not, not trying to change, you know, except for who you are. Um, one of the things that he talks about is that, you know, if you're going to be a loser, well, accept it that you're a loser. But it's not about not giving a fuck about life in general. It's about, he's talking about things that, that what you're going to give a fuck about. For example, that I know that I'm fat and obese. I need to lose weight. And that's something that I give, and I don't give a fuck about being obese, but I do give a fuck about my health. And we know about the health implications of being morbidly obese. And, and trust me, it's a fucking struggle. It's just the day to day things that you have trouble with. So, and one of the things that, and one of the characters that he, the superhero that he wants to create is called Disappointment Bander, <laughs> where he goes around and telling you the half, the hard truths. Which, let's be honest, the truth hurts, and it's hard to accept the truth. And also that he talks about what happened to Dave Mustaine. If you don't know who Dave Mustaine is, he was from uh, Megadeth. But originally he was the guitarist for Metallica. Anyway, one day they were over in New York and touring and um, they were at a hotel and they got drunk. And um, they told him that he was fired and gave him a bus ticket home. And uh, and he was really pissed off and he decided to um, prove Metallica wrong. So he decided to start up Megadeth, which he became successful himself, but in a 2003 documentary, Some Kind of Monster, that Lars and Dave sat down and they talked to each other and Dave was basically still hurt and pissed off about this. And, but also, the original drummer of the Beatles, Pete Best. Well, none of the band's members liked him. So the Arxys manager, they asked their manager to get rid of him. But his manager couldn't do it because he quite liked the guy. So anyway, eventually, um, the manager of the band fired Pete Best. And of course, that he was bitter and angry, as you would be. Um, but eventually, he got over it. And his values changed, especially because in a 1994 interview, he said that um, that he doesn't feel bad about it. And that's that's the key word that you values. What is he going to value? And also, what are the things that you're going to quite willing to sacrifice? Yeah, I'm going to sacrifice going to the gym three times a week. Yeah, you know, to do a workout so I can lose weight and eat healthily. Which, to be honest, I'm not 100% there yet, but I know I need to lose weight. And what I like about this book that is, it doesn't, it's no bullshit, it's quite relatable that what's he saying. Um, and the, the narration 
of the book by Roger Ayn was quite, quite good, yeah, excellent. Um, yeah, he's a really good voice. He, uh, and especially the voice of Disappointment Bender was spot on. Um, he did a really good thing, so I recommend, I highly recommend listening to this audio book. Anyway, thank you for listening. I'm Adam Gus Gully from All Things Audio Books and Podcasts. Um, subscribe. I'm going to upload once a week, every Sunday. So, And also, leave me a comment on, on any other audio books that you, that you recommend that I should listen to. Uh, I've got some coming up. Um, especially that um, once I... One of the things that I'm going to do is um, I'm going to link this into playlist once I get more material started up, um, get more books and listening and talk about it to you guys. Um, one of the things that I want to download all seven Harry Potter books and 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 I want to put them in a playlist. Playlist that um, and basically what I'm going to and I'm not going to do it from chronological order. Um, I'm going to do it from my most favourite. Harry Potter book to my least favourite Harry Potter book and it's not so much going to be a review I'm just going to talk about mainly the narration um, what I like about this book how it resonated because Harry Potter is a cultural phenomenon so I'll keep you guys updated for that anyway thanks for listening